Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your May 2018 reading. Uh, happy birthday! Sorry that I wasn't able to get the rest, the second half of April 2018 readings out. It's just been crazy. I'm dealing with loss in the family, closing down one business. I'm all over the place. Anyhow, let's get started, okay? And I'll save the announcements to the end, okay? All right, so I have shuffled and prayed over the cards, but we'll give the cards a quick shuffle, and then we'll get started. Let's start with love, you know? That's what everybody want to know anyway, you know, you know. Um, When I was shuffling off camera, some really good cards were popping out for you guys. I don't, um, I'm not exactly sure where everyone is in love, but I'm hoping that it's, it's in a good space. So thank you, thank you, thank you, heavenly angels, for showing Taurus via the tarot the messages for love, true, accurate messages for love for Taurus. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope that um, your birthday, if it's your birthday, it starts off well, all right? Some of my good friends are Taurus, like we get along. I'm a Aquarius sun, Aries rising. I'm going to take that one. If it comes back out, we'll take it. And then a Libra moon, so I've got double air. So, I don't know. All right, bottom of the deck, four of water. Okay, so someone... Is bored in a situation. Someone's not taken to an offer, maybe extended from a water sign, or if not extended from a water sign, maybe someone's not taking your offer. We'll see what this is all about. Four water at the bottom of the deck. The the heart of the matter, the messenger of water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and then the messenger of air crosses it. We got two two messengers, two two. Two offers here. Someone is offering, of course, their cup of love. Someone's offering truth, truth and clarity, their truth, their clarity on a situation. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The basis for all of the energy is the tower. Wow. I did see the tower when it was, when I was shuffling off camera. So the tower is about, you know, the universe, God, your spirit guides, your your ancestors, your angels, breaking down a foundation that was faulty anyway, a situation maybe that you, you stayed in or are in too long, something that's expired, something that needs to change. All right, let's see where you are. And justice, wow, this is really good to majors here. Uh, justice, some of you could be dealing with the Libra. If not dealing with the Libra, you could be dealing with the legal system. You could work in a legal system. You could, once again, be dealing with a court court case. Uh, also, this breaking down of a foundation or a faulty one at that could bring you some actual karmic justice, some balancing of the scales. What seemed off balance in the in the past or presently can now be righted here in the, in the probably the near future. All right, let's see. In the past, we had the Queen of Water. Some of you are definitely dealing with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is particular. Most times, this is Cancer, Queen of Water. Very intuitive, very in touch with her emotions, him or her. You see the woman's eyes is closed. She's in tune. She's focused. Focused on what the universe will bring her via her, her emotions, her mind. All right, moving forward, the near future, the nine of water, nice. You're getting exactly what you want, a wish fulfilled, wish fulfillment, um, <clears throat> indulgence. Um, nice. Recognition. Yeah, just some, some, some real good energy here. Nine of water. Some of you definitely dealing with a water sign. You've got two offers here. 
Or I feel like this might even be the same person offering you. They're offering you the cup of emotion, wanting to invest within you, with you. They're also giving you some truth and clarity about the situation as a whole. Your power. The wheel of fortune. Nice. The wheel is turning in your favor. What's happening is supposed to happen. It's destined to happen. You couldn't get away from it if you wanted to. This is also an ending. This is a 10 card. The number 10 card. It's um. You've gone as far and now it's time for the wheel to, to turn again. You've gone as far as you can go in a certain situation, in a certain dynamic. Now it's time to move forward. External to you, the ten of fire, someone laying down the burden, someone carrying a heavy load, fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. Either they're carrying a heavy load and they're laying it down eventually, or you view this person as a burden, this fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, I heard that, Leo, you view them as a burden. Hopes and fears, eight of fire, you want things to move fast, it's rapid communication in regards to a situation, also nicknamed the arrows of love, there's communication back and forth about um, maybe a new start in love, okay? And the outcome is the page of fire. A message could be something to do with a child, but a message that propels you to take action. This message is most times it's conditional if it's attached to a person of interest. If it's just a message from, you know, he say, she say, then it's a message that'll make you, you know, take action. But if it's a particular message from maybe a fire sign Aries Sagittarius Leo it's a, it's a conditional message you know the page of fire this is not a night of fire this isn't the king of fire the page of fire is a bit immature it's a new start of passion so it's it's that give and take it's that tug and that tug of war it's that, it's that pull and it's that push it's the if you do then I will do if you will go if I, I will go if you say then I'll do you know it's conditional this person is all about the action about the passion you can be dealing with a person like that some of you dealing with a fire sign some of you dealing with water but water looks really good some the foundation is breaking down here if you're dealing with maybe an air water sign Libra in particular, um, four of water. Someone's not taken to an offer. You might not be taken to this water signs offer, but I really feel like you should. And what was under the four of water was the higher fence. So I know it's you that's not taken to the offer. I really feel like it's good for you, but you know you have to go through the motions of getting to a place where you can't even have wish fulfillment. Some of you are stuck in something relationship-wise, career-wise. You're stuck in a place where you cannot build with another person or another entity. All right? What is the justice card? What is the justice card? What is the justice card? The messenger of fire. So, Knight of Wands, someone who's okay, and that fell on the tower. Ace of Earth, nice. So, it looks like something breaks down, and then you have a new foundational start. Um, see, this could be career, too. Messenger of Fire here with Justice. Something's moving very quickly. Messenger of Fire with Justice. This person being in and out or indecisive or just, you know, an all-around flight risk, you felt like it was unfair. And you felt like they could come in and come out whenever Four of Earth, right? whenever they want it to you're holding on to your emotions and exactly how you feel you're not letting them in again it looks like this maybe this aries sagittarius leo that leo right here in four of fire 
this Aries Sagittarius Leo um, that comes in and out, does the back and forth thing, you're not letting them in again. You normally let them in and as far as let them into your space, let them into your circle, let them into your heart sector. It looks like you're gonna you you you're you're taming yourself, your emotions in regards to this relationship, the four of fire, and you're trying to maintain stability. We got two fours here. Fours are about our stability. You're trying to maintain your stabil stability emotionally, because this person or this entity or whatever you want to call it, man or woman, they 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 do as they please. They come and they go. Um, they want what they want. They have no regard for the mess that they leave or the mess that they make. The mess that they make, that is your 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 emotions, your heart, your you you wanting to invest. It look, yeah, four, 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 four. Taking back that control, getting that back into that leadership, leadership of your own life. You're not taking to an offer. You're not letting them in. You'll be having strength in regards to this relationship. You know what you want. I think the universe brought the tower down, but you also brought it down too because you want a new foundational start. And it looks like you may get your wish here. Um, right. That was right. What I said, this fire sign external to you is a burden. And it looks like you want to drop it. You've gone as far as you can go with this. You might even be having, sometimes the eight of fire is rapid communication about the trouble in a relationship due to jealousy and greed. And then they come with their immature ass page of fire and the outcome with this conditional message when it's like, dude or, or girl, I have invested so much. Do you, and you come with this, this, this message, this small ass offer, like, ooh, I'm getting picking up somebody's energy. I don't even really curse in my readings. Somebody's upset. Not even really upset, but it's more so it's a it's an air of I've been quiet for so long. I need to say what I need to say. And how it comes out is how it comes out. So that's love for you. All right? Not taking to a water signs offer. Possibly not even an air sign. Definite fire is fire better run from you. Um yeah, I didn't see much earth, earth on earth, no, so we'll just say that earth, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, like yourself, you guys are doing well, we'll just say that, how about that, alright, so let's do a career spread for Taurus, what is, what is career looking like for Taurus, what are the messages for Taurus and career and finance, career and finance for Taurus, messages for Taurus and career and finance messages for Taurus and career and finance true accurate messages for Taurus messages of love and light messages to guide their lives their career lives thank you thank you thank you thank you, thank you. of the deck the hierophant you showed up yay okay happy birthday Taurus is on it um gaining getting under some type of reign and rule for yourself to uh whatever that may be it could be spiritually it could be um uh, getting a regimen for yourself um you see how these two Ooh, eight of cups under that yeah um you see how these two men are they're they're bowing at the foot of the hierophant because he or she has ultimate knowledge occult knowledge hang on guys my battery is dying
Okay, Taurus, so my battery died, so here we are. Um, right, the Hierophant. Getting under some type of reign and rule, some regimen in your life um, so that you can get to the next sector, so that you can gain ultimate um, knowledge of. This could be in your of a new career, in your current career. See, the Devil, could be dealing with the Capricorn, the Empress. The Chariot, the Two of Wands. This is definitely, if it's in career, some of you have an office romance. There's three people here, and then the Empress definitely have an office romance or something in regards to a, a big institution. Could be. you are actively trying to move to a different sector in career or a different sector or a different person you have someone else dividing your time you have someone that you're di dividing your your interests your your energy with then you're already in something you're already married you might be contemplating walking away because you want to build. Wow. This is definitely at work. And are you getting that recognition that the stroke of the of the ego from this other person? It's very new, but you know that it can grow. Wow. Yeah. After you leave a certain situation or cut a certain situation or take yourself out of a certain situation you can then offer something very stable that will offer lots of balance but you gotta be like the queen of swords and get very truthful with yourself and cut something out so you can have that new passionate start a new foundational start and be like the fool and start over but you've got to make that decision about a relationship, possibly with a, an Aquarius. Or you've got to heal from a past relationship. Or you know that you provide the healing waters for the other partner. If you are the cheating spouse, you've got to do the work to heal or help heal. You're weighing up very, too, very real tangible options here there's you you want happiness you want things to move quickly queen of wands is typically the other woman other man gosh yeah this is all in work this is all in work uh is someone you work with or work for or work around um you want to move away from some of you Taurus want to move away from a certain situation um, you have someone else who you want to deal with who you're actively building um, and if that's career then you have someone that then you have another company or career that you want to move to you want to move uh, closer to um, start to really um, engage in that career but I really feel like it's a relationship all right so let's do some three things that and these have reversals this this deck has reversals um, three things that Taurus should know and you guys are getting this because it's your birthday and then we'll do the additional uh, uh, support cards angel Butterfly Oracle cards. All right, three cards of a of three cards for additional messages for Taurus. What should Taurus know about themselves? Three cards. All right. Right. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Someone is dropping this juggling act. They, they're making a decision here. That's your energy. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. 
justice. Once again, someone is going through the legal system, divorce, court case, scales are being balanced. What was wrong in the past will be righted. The tower, yeah. I guess you're going to drop the juggling act and avoid, avoid a tower situation and just go ahead and make the decision yourself so that the universe didn't have to come in and make it for you. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. You're no longer looking back on a situation, looking at a situation that you've invested time into, uh, energy into, money into. You no longer care. Seven of Pentacles upright would be, I'm looking at what I've invested in. I want a return on this investment. I want things to pan out in the way that I thought they would. I am waiting. Seven of Pentacles in reverse is, I no longer care. Yes, I wasted time. Yes, I wasted energy. But at this point, I don't care. I'm making a decision to drop the ball on this whole juggling act. Have justice. Go through the... Let the chips fall how they gonna fall. That's how. That's where you guys are. That's a good place to be, though. You know? Like, always, always sneaking around and carrying on with people. You know? It gets old. In the beginning, it's fun. What's the saying? Uh, stolen waters are sweeter. Yeah, in the beginning, but as you get older, as you get a little bit wiser, you understand that, hey, this shit is just not for me. I ain't got time to be sneaking behind buildings and staying at work late to wait on you uh, or wait on somebody when I can just go home and tell the other somebody that I don't want to be with the ass no more. You know? Um, just make things a lot easier. You know? Just and clear out all the drama for yourself and everyone involved. Like, this is, I love it, Taurus. Some of you are getting real with yourself. All right. Let's go. Support. Support is here for you. If you felt like there is not support, uh, we did have the Five of Pentacles. Some of you may feel like um, there is you feel left out, you feel there is lack, you feel like there isn't support in the direction of career, of uh, relationship, there isn't support, no one will support this new found change that you want to institute in your life, there is support. Even if it's not in your friend and family sector, there's support in, in other people, in different groups. Healing from the past, most definitely. We had the star card. You gotta heal from that so that you can move forward and get newness because newness is here for you. Memories, and I think that's what what holds you back. The memories of um, we didn't have the five of cups, did we? Nope, we didn't. But uh, memories, 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 the, and they're just what they are. Memories. Remember it and keep moving. Um, I know easy said and done, right? Uh, Memories and, and the memories might be of a of good memories of bad memories, but it might be memories that move you to a place of knowing that you you must heal from this because you keep remembering it, whatever it may be for you. Uh, but there's support support groups. Wow, this is for somebody. Somebody's going through something. Someone has gone through something. Someone's holding on to a secret um, or something happening in the past the very far past, I don't want to say recent, could be recent, but someone's holding on to something that is um, pretty heavy in the memories of it, just re, you know, just, you know, really make you come to a place of really feeling like you you have to get help and support to heal from this. The bottom of the deck, family changes. So some of you could be having some happy and wanted additions. Some of you could be um, moving in with someone, moving somebody out, kicking somebody out, uh, moving home, uh, buying a pet. I mean, it could be so many different things here. Um, Family changes, though. Someone could be deciding to get married, leaving someone in, deciding to divorce, kicking their ass out. Uh, Taurus, thank you, thank you, thank you for your time. 
thank you for uh, trusting me to read for you. I hope that this you took something from this message. Um, if you did not, check your moon and rising sign. Um, also, uh, check out my new website. It's um, tarotofl at gmail at tarotofl.com and my email is tarotofl at gmail.com um, it should be below uh, all information is in this, the description box uh, once again I just thank you guys for taking the time out to uh, listen to this and, and gain clarity on your situation uh, take advantage of my subscription services also uh, subscribe to um to my website receive uh, either a five minute audio photo reading every month about the general energy surrounding you or uh, subscribe and receive a 15 minute reading um, about you every month or a 10 minute reading whatever you think will best fit or suit your life uh, for the changes that are coming for you okay all right, so Taurus, remember, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you guys. Go over to the website, subscribe. Um, the first 50 subscribers will receive a free 10-minute reading. Um, check that out, all right? Partake in it. Subscribe to the channel here. Also, click that like button, all right? Take care, guys, and thanks again.